Now, a map shape transforms one structured data format or profile into another. In our case, we'll be transforming our XML files to CSV flat files. Each map contains a source profile, which is your input data, which we can see over here on the left-hand side of our map shape, and a destination profile, or your output data, which we can see along the right side of our screen here within our map shape. Now these profiles can be imported into the map based on a sample file or schema, or they can even be manually created. Once the profiles are loaded, it's time to map the corresponding elements. So to map the elements, you simply drag and drop each source profile element to one or more destination profile elements. So as you can see on the screen right now, the company ID is now mapped to the account ID, moving from the source profile over to the right in the destination profile. And we can tell that those two are connected based off of that gray bar.